How's it going guys? It's time for another video in our Xbox Ambassador series. If you'd like more information on the Xbox Ambassador program, be sure to go to community.xbox.com slash ambassadors. Now today's gonna be a quick but important video as we're gonna be talking about how to manage your privacy and online safety settings directly from your Xbox One console. Obviously very important stuff as it gives you the power to decide exactly what people can see about you while you're on Xbox Live. So from anyone on the console, you can double tap the Xbox Guide button, scroll down to the gears icon and select all settings. From the settings menu and account, you can scroll to the right to privacy and online safety, then select Xbox Live Privacy. So what you're gonna see here are a few different account types. We're specifically gonna be dealing with adult defaults. Just know that there are options available for other account types. So scroll down to view details and customize. And here's where it gets really cool. Instead of offering presets that change your settings in chunks, Xbox Live allows you to go in here and refine each and every tiny detail so that your privacy settings are exactly how you want them. And we'll walk through a few examples. The first of which being whether others can see if you're online or not. Now by default, it's set to everybody, but say I only want my friends to be able to see whether I'm online or not. I can select everybody, which brings up a drop down menu and just select friends. And just like that, only my friends will be able to see whether I'm online or not. And those options are available for many different settings here, such as whether others can communicate with you via voice and text message. I'll set that to friends as well. And you can do that for a whole bunch of different things, such as whether others can see your music history, your friends list, your game clips and screenshots, a whole bunch of different options. Now, Xbox Live also allows you to share your real name, which is really cool. But if you don't want to do that, you can go ahead and change that also to just friends, for example. Or you can even set it to friends I choose, so only specific friends will be able to see your real name. You can even change how your name appears. Just a whole bunch of different options, such as whether or not you can broadcast gameplay. If I want to block that, I can do that. Now, the really cool thing is if you go back, you'll now see a custom bar. These are your customized privacy settings that you just changed. But if you want to go back to the default, it's really simple. All you got to do is scroll up to adult defaults and select it. It'll then ask you if you're sure you want to switch back to the defaults and you hit switch. And just like that, your uh, settings are switched back to the adult defaults. And the customization options don't end there. You can also set your contact preferences with Xbox Live. Um, it allows you to set whether or not you're sent specific offers about music, video, and games from Xbox. I'll go ahead and check that because I think that's pretty cool. You can also decide whether you are, are sent uh, promotional offers about products uh, partnered with Xbox, like games and accessories. So there are a lot of cool options. So Xbox Live really allows you to go in there and set your settings to exactly how you want, and it gives you the power to make sure that you are safe while online. Hopefully this video was able to help you out, and if it, and if it did, please be sure to hit the thumbs up button and subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you next time. Peace.